Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Welcome to the channel if you are just joining and stumbling across this video. So as you can see I've got my big chunky jumper on. I've brought them out of my wardrobe. It is officially now autumn. It is currently chucking it down outside and I thought this would be a good time to film this video. I've been meaning to do this for a while and just kind of show you what I wear in a week. So it's Sunday today so I'm planning my outfits in advance for this week. So I'm literally going to show you Monday to Sunday. I've got a really busy week coming up so I kind of want to plan my outfits in advance know what I'm wearing and make sure they're all in my wardrobe washed and ready to go so like I said it's autumn winter and I feel like I want to make some outfits that are going to be core staples in my wardrobe around good basics layering them how to style them and I'm teaming up with Uniqlo in this video so Uniqlo honestly are such a good brand for your core pieces in your wardrobe your parka coats your jumpers really good quality cashmere jumpers fleeces trench coats, trousers, t-shirts, you name it, those staples and core pieces. So I'm going to be creating all of these looks from Monday to Sunday, how I wear them, even if I would be styling them from like day to night as well, just to give you some inspo on how to really utilize your wardrobe and how to create different looks out of the same pieces as well. And as always, these pieces will be linked down below in the description and I also leave my size reference as well so you can kind of use it as a guide. So I'm going to get straight into it and show you how I'm styling my outfits for this upcoming week. Monday so Monday I have a breakfast event in the morning and then later on I'm going shopping so I want to wear something that I can obviously take on and off if I'm going to be hot and also want to still be warm whilst I'm walking about and also be comfortable but also looking put together and chic for the event as well so kind of taking in mind this is obviously going to be an everyday look so starting off with this gorgeous cashmere jumper I say this a lot but it's quality over quantity guys just investing in a nice good cashmere jumper that you know is going to last you throughout the season and seasons to come like next year and the year after so I love the fact that this is cream it really goes well mixing it in with the different tones of the beiges that I'm going to show you as well and then I've also just slicked my hair back this is generally how I would wear my hair with a roll neck. I think it just looks a lot more sleek. So I went for a size small in this just because I like it to have a little bit of room. Then I've tucked it in to some tailored trousers and then I've matched the colour of the tailored trousers to this gorgeous lightweight coat. And I feel like duster coats like this are great for the autumn season. You don't want it to be too thick and heavy so you can easily take this on and off. And especially if you're walking around the shops, I don't like to get too hot as well. So this actually fits quite nice. It is a little bit long in the arms but coat always are for me but I do like to go a little bit oversized in my coats and then it comes down and hits just a kind of like around the calf area so I feel like a good straight coat like this just brings the outfit together and mixing together these cream and brown tones is just so lush and then just simply wearing it with a pair of everyday trainers just to kind of make it a casual everyday look and obviously keep it comfy whilst showing off the ankles as well which is a more flattering look especially if you're on the more petite side like me then just tying it in with my cream Gucci bag and this is just a perfect look for an everyday Monday taking it from an event and then shopping so if I didn't say before this coat I did get in a size small and of course I will link it down below but I'm going to show you another way I'm going to wear this for Tuesday Tuesday I have a store appointment in the morning so I want to wear something that's easy to take on and off because obviously I'm going to be trying on outfits then I'm going to be shooting and I've got an event in the evening so I've gone for this jumper dress it's a turtle neck and it's in this gorgeous beige colour again similar to the Monday's outfit and then I've just styled it with a crossbody bag with black accessories and also black over the knee sorry knee high boots to tie it all in together but obviously this is lacking a coat so i'm going to show you how to wear the coat with this to tie it all in 
and this jumper dress actually is an extra small as you can see it's quite long it comes down to the knee length you can kind of just ruch up if you want to or even tie it in with a belt but i'm just going to wear it loose and i'm actually wearing a extra small so definitely recommend going at true to size in the jumper dress i just live in them in autumn especially in the season where you can still kind of get your legs out obviously i've got my knee high boots to cover my legs as well and then I've just laid on top the duster coat and you can see it just really brings in this outfit together. And these colours match perfect together, these brown chocolate beiges. I love them for autumn and winter. And again, this is just a really nice lightweight coat. So I know I'm not going to be too hot. And I love how this ties in nice with the colours. And then just again with the black accessories so you can see how it all comes together. Just hits kind of above the boots. Um, but yeah, I feel like I'm going to get my wear out of this coat so much and again, I keep saying it but I love the fact it is lightweight so I'm not going to be too hot. So Wednesday I have a day full of meetings so I just wanted a really everyday simple chic look that looks put together and obviously want to keep it quite tailored for the fact I do have meetings and keeping it smart. So these grey tailored trousers are Uniqlo, I love them, they're a little bit thicker so they're nice for the autumn winter to keep you warm. Also elasticated here at the back so they make them super comfortable and then they've got the little button, the pleats going down so it's got that nice tailored feel and then they cut off just at the ankle which I love again. So I've paired them with a nice pair of black loafers with my bag and accessories being gold to match. And then you can't go wrong with a good, basic, simple white tee. It's just a core piece in your wardrobe. Uniqlo do loads of different styles. I personally like this one. It's like the boxy feel. I did go for a size small in it. I just always like to go a little bit oversized. Tucked into the trousers and then just put a white duster coat on to bring in the white as well. So it just balances out the outfit. And again, it's lightweight with a t-shirt, tailored trousers, and then tying it in with the accessories as well. So this is just such a simple, every day look that you can recreate with pieces in your wardrobe but honestly I highly recommend getting these tailored trousers I love them in the grey Chris actually also has them they do them in men's and women's if you did want to know because he loves them and wears them a lot too and I love the fact you can put it with a few different colours and I think white just looks really nice with grey Okay, so for Thursday, I'm just having like a work from home, really chilled out look. I'll probably go to a coffee shop at lunch to work. So I just wanted to wear something that's comfy and just very casual. So a good way to also style these grey trousers, I'm wearing them again for Thursday, is just with pairing it with navy. I think navy and grey looks so nice together. And then I've just tied it all in with touches of white. So just easy throw on a shoulder bag and some white casual trainers. Again, I just wanna be really comfy, especially from working from home. I love these trousers. The fact, like I said before, they are elasticated. So they're really comfy and it just makes you feel like a little bit more put together from home as well. And then obviously because it is getting a little bit colder, just throw on a jumper. You don't really need to layer up again. So this is just a very casual outfit and another way to wear the grey trousers. I also love this navy jumper. It's such good quality and again I went for a size small. I feel like you can obviously wear this in a few different ways but this is how I'd wear it just for kind of like an everyday Look at home, we'll just pop into a coffee shop but wanting to look put together. Friday, best day of the week, 
and my plans for Friday are filming at home so I want to be quite casual on top because that's what's going to be shown on camera and then I'm going to be going out for a late lunch with friends which will probably lead into drinks so I want something that's going to be a little bit more dressy going into the evening as well so on top I've got this gorgeous cardigan on I'm a sucker for a cardigan at the minute I think they're really great for autumn throw on and obviously you can layer them you could put just a simple white tee underneath but I just quite like it like this and easy for me to film and have something that's quite neutral on top the material of this is just stunning it's like this nice fluffy warm material with the tortoise shell buttons went for a size small in it the sleeves actually aren't too long which is great and it fits really nice with the v-neck as well and then on top for when i do leave the house i've got this gorgeous trench coat on now i feel like this is a nice looks take on a trench coat it feels a bit more premium as you can see it's just got the one button that comes across so it isn't double breasted and then it has the button detail here on the sleeve which obviously you can tie tighter if you want and then I've just tied it at the back I like it to be quite loose and open and I always go a little bit oversized with the trench coats I feel like this just looks really luxe and I'm really really happy I actually picked this up went for a size small in the trench and I think this just works really well with the cardigan underneath and just shows you how you can layer and like I said if you did want to wear something underneath the cardigan as well you could even if you just wanted to put like a body and then as I said I'm going for a late lunch I want to look a little bit more dressy because I know it'll probably end up in going for drinks so I've just got some cream tailored flared trousers on with it paired it with a little bit of a heel for when we do go out and tied it in with my white shoulder bag as well so it's just a way to show you how I can look casual in the day obviously I can just take the trench off at lunch look quite casual but then going out in the evening just dressing it up with a nice flare trouser a little bit of a pop of heel and you're good to go so it's just about layering and playing around with the pieces in your wardrobe but I feel like this is just such a great Friday look if you kind of want to take it from day to night or even if you're at the desk at work you can look put together and chic have your coat over the top and then also dress it up in the evening and if obviously you didn't want to wear heels all day you can just put some trainers on in the day just to make it a little bit more everyday and comfy as well And then this outfit for Saturday, just very dressed down, easy, laid back look. Go for brunch in the morning, usually meet friends in the afternoon and go on like a long walk. So I've just got this striped jumper on. I love the fact that this is kind of cream and black mixed with the stripes. It just adds a little bit of interest on top. Layered the trench coat over the top of it. I really love this trench. I know I'm going to wear it so much. Just ties in nice with the cream as well. Simple pair of jeans on the bottom. And again, if I didn't say with the jumper, I went for small. Usually always go for small with my jumpers and coats. Just like I'm a little bit oversized. And then just paired with a simple trainer just for a really comfy casual look I feel like you can't go wrong with a nice trench knit and some jeans so yeah I highly recommend getting at this striped knit because I feel like this would also look nice kind of layered over the trench as well over your shoulders even if you just had the white tee on with the jeans and then had the jumper over the top just in case you did want to layer so this is just a really simple laid back Saturday look We've made it till Sunday if you've made it till the end of this video. Sunday is very much my comfy chill out day. All I want to wear is comfortable wear and I love this cream, just really oversized, loose knit. I feel like this is just what you need on a comfortable day. Paired with these leggings and these are the thermal leggings, they're like extra heat which actually is so perfect they're quite thin and I'm going at skiing in December so these are going to be great to layer also layering if you've just got like leather trousers in the day but obviously on a Sunday I'm just going to wear these on their own big oversized knit and then I'll show you the jacket that I'm going to put on to wear for the dog walk and also with this I went for a size small as you can see it's quite oversized just really flowy which I love and then also with the leggings I actually went extra small and they fit absolutely great really nice fit actually and then they come 
down to your ankles. Then over the tops, I always go on a nice long dog walk with Bailey on a Sunday. This is the ultra light down jacket, and I kid you not, this is like a feather. It is so light, which is actually perfect. Say if you're going away and you wanna pack a jacket, something like this is so easy to pack, because it's so thin, yet also keeps you really warm. And also, these puffer jackets are very in the season, very on trend, and I went for it in this olive color. They do do it in a few different colors, like a cream color, black, I think they do navy, but I really liked this olive, and I think it just looks nice with the cream, paired with your tights, just easy, and then I'll probably put like my welly boots on to go for a walk, so it'll match in with the olive as well. So, really happy I actually picked this up, because I saw on the website it was like ultra light, and I was like, surely not, because it's a puffer jacket, but it really is. And again, I went for a size small in it, and it fits great and also in the arms too which I'm happy with. So that is it guys, hopefully you made it till the end of this video to see all of my outfits from Monday to Sunday, how I plan them and how I create different looks out of them. Like you saw with the trench coat, the tailored trousers, the jumpers, you can just create different looks out of these core pieces and just styling them at different ways, especially for different occasions as well, like how I showed you can dress it up in the evening on a Friday and then how I just do like my dress down looks on a Sunday as well. So as always all these pieces will be linked in the description like I said with size references in case you missed it as well but if you do like these videos I'll definitely come back and do more of like what I wear in a week so do give it a like it's a really good indicator for me and make sure to hit subscribe so you don't miss the upcoming videos and I'll see you guys in the next one